Assalamu alaikum, this is Go Lifestyles. So today we'll be going to a trip to Tobermory. Tobermory is located towards the north and is around a 3 hour There are over 20 shipwrecks in this area, however, these two are the most visible ones. The first one here is called the Sweepstakes. It sank in 1885 near Cove Island. It got repaired, however, it sank again and has been at the same spot since then. The water in this area is so clear and because these ships lay in fresh water, the wrecks here are in perfect condition. So this cruise here offers a glass bottom as you can see here, which here isn't like the traditional ones and goes pretty fast compared to the other ones we've been on. At this point, the water was super deep, so it was quite fun. This is also a double deck cruise, so you can get different views, which was really nice. pricey over here so we ended up not doing it. There are also a lot of islands here at Tobermory. Um, I think there are around 30 or even more located and you can see that people were swimming at those islands. However, um, they're not accessible through the cruise so um, we were headed to the flower pot island, which is around, I'd say, a 30 minute to an hour um, cruise. So here we were pretty close to the flower pot island. The island is famous for its natural flower pot rock, pillars, caves, historical light stations, and rare plants. The flower pot are the type of sea stack which was formed over many years by wind, rain, waves, ice, and just water hitting it and forming it naturally. Breath taking views. Um, I would definitely recommend to bring an extra pair of clothes or snacks if you're coming here because you would definitely want to go for a swim. Also, one of the mistakes that our family did was not bringing any snacks because we thought that there would be food available at the island, but um, we were wrong and there was no type of food that was available or snacks that, that were available at this island. And since you do stay there for three hours, um, you get pretty hungry, especially after the swim. So um, I would definitely recommend you bringing some snacks with you. So there are two types of flower pot that were formed. This one is the big one and then there's also a smaller one um, right across this. The beaches here are super rocky and there's also really really big rocks um, near the trails so it kind of gets a little scary since you know that there's snakes um, in the area. Um, I would recommend you to wear sturdy shoes if you want to go hiking or just even walking on the beach. Also the water at Tobermory is super super cold so at first you will feel a little colder but then you do get used to the temperature so it should be fine. Here we were just hiking and enjoying, however my mom was super stressed about the snakes even though they aren't venomous 
and funny enough we ended up seeing two of them and she was super scared while we were laughing so because of the snakes my mom gul made us return and get on the cruise an hour earlier than our time just because she was scared So here my mom's just shooting some beautiful scenes for you guys and she just works so hard on these scenes and putting all of them together so a big shout out to her and I would definitely ask you guys to subscribe and show